where to find the mangrove swamp in Minecraft. This video will explain what the mangrove swamp is and where to find it. What is the mangrove swamp? The mangrove swamp is a new swamp variant added in the 1.19 update, the wild update. The mangrove swamp is similar to the swamp, but there are some key differences. The mangrove swamp will have mangrove trees covering the surface. This is the only place to find the mangrove trees in the game. The mangrove trees will be composed of mangrove leaves, mangrove logs, vines, mangrove roots, moss carpet, and muddy mangrove roots. The mangrove leaves are similar to other leaves. When they decay or break, they will drop mangrove propagals, the mangrove sapling, and sticks. The difference between the mangrove leaves and other leaves is they appear to have a more dense and different texture. The mangrove logs are like other logs in the game. There will be a smaller trunk than other trees because the way the mangrove tree grows. The mangrove of logs have a similar but different texture than the jungle logs. The mangrove planks and mangrove wood has a vermilion color. From the trunk of the tree will be the mangrove roots that branch out in different directions into the ground and on top of them can be moss carpet. The mangrove roots are a decorative block. If you mine them they will drop as a block. You don't need a specific tool or one with silk touch. The mangrove root can be used in the furnace to smelt 1.5 items and the composter is a 30% chance to increase the compost post level by one and can be crafted with a mud block to get muddy mangrove root. The mangrove root also can be waterlogged and a redstone signal can pass through the root even when waterlogged. Below the mangrove roots will be muddy mangrove roots, which when mined will drop as a block. The muddy mangrove root is a decorative block and has no other uses. The mangrove propagal also can grow on the mangrove leaves. The surface of the mangrove swamp will be covered with mud blocks and patches of grass. The mud is also a new block. This is the only location it will generate in the game. If you want a large quantity quantity of mud, this is a good location to mine blocks of it. You can also get mud from applying a water bottle to a dirt, coarse dirt, and rooted dirt block. The mud block can also be crafted with wheat to create a packed mud block. This is a decorative block and the only way to get it. Four packed mud can be crafted together to get one mud brick block. Also with a mud block, if a pointed dripstone is placed on the bottom of it, this can turn the mud block into a clay block. The amount of time this takes can vary widely, but this seems about the same as filling a cauldron with water, so about 7 minutes on average. This is the only way to get a renewable clay block in the game. The mangrove swamp is also also one of the only two biomes that the frog spawns in, the other biome being the swamp biome. The frogs in this biome will be white as the color corresponds to the temperature of the biome and white frogs spawn in warmer biomes. If you want to know more about the frogs, I'll have a card on the top right. The frogs will jump around and can swim. The unique ability of the frog is that they can use their tongues and kill small slimes and magma cubes. With magma cubes, they can turn magma cubes into frog lights, which is a new block that will be one of three colors depending on the frog's color. The frogs can be bred using slime balls and will generate frog spawn on the water. The frog spawn will spawn tadpoles that will swim around and need to be in water. After 20 minutes, these tadpoles will turn into frogs. You can also pick up the tadpoles in the water bucket and transport them to a different biome if you want a specific color. Tropical fish will also spawn in this biome. The glow squid can also spawn in the mangrove swamp. The spawning requirements are still the same, they need to spawn in complete darkness. However, my assumption is that they can generate in the biome and they don't have to be below Y layer 30 like other biomes. Slimes can also spawn in this biome, but are a lot rarer than in the swamp biome. I assume it is similar to the swamp biome. The slimes spawn between Y layer 50 and 70 and below light level 7, so usually at night. Also, the phase of the moon affects the spawning, being more often at full moon and never on a new moon. Hostile mobs like spiders, zombies, zombie villagers, skeleton creepers, endermen, and witches can spawn in the biome at total darkness. There are less mobs that can spawn in this biome than the swamp, as mobs like sheep, cows, pigs, and chickens don't spawn in this biome. Where to find the mangrove swamp biome? The swamp biomes are in the temperate biome cluster, meaning the biomes that group together based on temperature. The mangrove swamp can be found next to jungles and desert biomes. From playing the snapshots, the mangrove swamps seem to be next to or close to the swamp biomes. The mangrove swamp is an uncommon biome, so it may be difficult to find. 